But who do you like in this one? I think with USC's defense doing what they're doing, they can really throw a wrinkle into what Arizona State's offense is. Well, I think this is a different USC team than the USC team that we saw lose two games earlier in the season. I think the main reason is I think that Pete Carroll finally understood, and, and I think he understood all along, but he said, look, we've got to get one running back, one bell cow that we can really depend on, and Chauncey Washington, I think, has been that guy from now here as of late. Obviously, two weeks ago against Cal, 220 yards rushing. And the interesting thing is this. You know, people have talked about John David Booty and how he maybe hasn't been a Carson Palmer, Matt Liner. You know what he has been? When he has a consistent run again, we forget about Lendell White and Reggie Bush. Now that he's had Chauncey Washington, last two weeks, what's John David Booty? Three touchdowns, no interceptions. That's the whole story of this team. Know who you are. USC plays great defense. They run the ball. They play action off of it. Arizona State, though, their one strength is run defense. 16th in the country in run defense. I think that matchup is the matchup within the matchup. And whoever wins that will go a long way in determining the champion. And that's why I think USC it, will win. It, it's, it's interesting. A few weeks back, he was saying Sanchez should be the starter. Now he's all on the, the booty bandwagon again. You yeah, I do remember that, actually. Remember that? Actually, yeah. that was when you threw me under the bus and I didn't have a choice. <laughs> no, no, oh, no. you didn't have a choice? Let's it's not, never his fault. Yeah, it's never his fault. He's always the viewer at home and talk about Listen, you talk about Chauncey and you're right. That running game is helping booty out. But the reason that Eric Arizona State is playing so well is because of their running game as well. Mm -hmm. uh, you got uh, Keegan Herring. He's the main guy. And the loss versus Oregon, only 83 yards. Uh, the win versus UCLA, 116 yards. He has to be the main catalyst for this offense to open things up in the passing game. But that being said, mm -hmm. I agree with you. This USD, USC defense is just too tough. You talk about their secondary with Terrell Thomas and, and Taylor Mays back there leading the way. They're just going to lock these receivers up. They're going to force Arizona State, which notoriously this season has gotten off to a slow start which they can't do. We said that in the Oregon game. They went down. They get off to a slow start against SC. They have no no chance, no hope for them. Do you remember I when Trev Albert wins. said the Florida Gators were the most, this coming into this year, the most overrated team in the last 10 years? I think the same thing about the USC Trojans. This team, one of the most overrated in the last 10 years. And that came back one. to bite me, and that comment you just made. No, it will not. Arizona State will win the game at home. How about that?